School is an amazing place for learning and growing into the people we want to be. But not for everyone. What if something holds you back that's not your fault? Colour blindness or colour vision deficiency affects 1 in 12 boys and 1 in 200 girls. This means one in every classroom might be struggling. But because most teachers aren't trained about colour blindness, they might not even notice. I just started school. So much happens every day. I don't understand why my teacher keeps saying I got it wrong, because it looks okay to me. I'm really confused. I just want to get it right. Everyone is getting straight on with it. How can they work out which pencil to use? I wish they had the colours written on them. I hope the teacher doesn't ask me to answer any questions in front of everyone. At the time we did paintings of ourselves, I still don't understand why everyone was laughing at my picture. It was so embarrassing. I'm really glad I made the team. I love playing. Now we're at secondary school and there's lots of new faces. I struggle to tell who's on my team. I know I'm playing slower, but the bibs look exactly the same. And those cones are so hard to see. I think the PE teacher has noticed, but I hope he doesn't drop me. Science is cool. Trying experiments and working things out is really fun. Sometimes I find it hard when we have to tell things apart using colour. The teachers keep telling me it's really simple, so I'm sure it must be. If I can't even understand this exam, what will happen to me next? What about uni? Or that apprenticeship that I've applied for? It's not that I don't understand, but it's just so hard to tell the colours apart. It's not fair, after I've spent ages revising. Maybe I just shouldn't have done this subject. Thousands of children like us have situations like this every single day. Maybe teachers and coaches need more information to know how to help us. If you think someone might be struggling, then it's your responsibility to do something. Be open to the signs. Find out how to help.